Hi, it's Scott at McKenzie Meadows. I wanted to show you about our flight scope technology and how we integrate that into our lessons. So head pro Richard Hardy is gonna take a video of me giving you a video. So what I have here is I've taken a video of one of our students and what's cool about flight scope is it also captures the data of his swing. In this case, this student here, um, we've, he's taken a swing FlightScope's a radar technology that captures the ball's flight, captures the club, the student, exactly what's going on. And in this student's case, he's hit a shot here for us. And what, what's happened is, it'll show us exactly what's happened on the shot. So right here you can see his total distance uh, was 214 yards carry. It had a lot of roll because he had a closed club face. and we were trying to find out the significance of, of the problem within his swing. Now this was a pretty good ball, but he told me his problem was he every now and then would blow him off high and to the right. And basically we can see things on your video and we can learn things from the data. This brings both those applications together, the data and the video so that I can help the student learn. So here I'm just gonna show you what his club face angle looks like. And right here it says club path is 11.4 degrees to the right. So his ball flight is going to travel right of the tar target line with a square club face. Luckily on this particular shot, up here it says face to path. He's 10.1 degrees closed or 10.1 degrees left of, his, of, the, of the path line. That's what brought the ball back. So he has a very inside to out swing with a very close club face. What happens is in his game is every now and then he gets one and he blows it high right, say on 10, 11, and 12 at McKenzie Meadows, and you go down that stretch with blowing it high and right because your path is so far from the inside and you don't ha close the club face that exact degree and all of a sudden you've had a bad day go to a terrible day just because of the shape of the hole. Um, so we did some work, we came back, and um, I'll look at another swing we did a little later and bring up the data to his swing so I can bring his swing in. And the reason we want the video is I help him learn how to correct the mistake. And in this one, you can see he's hit it 261 yards, okay, he's just a little bit right of the target line. And um, when we look at his club face angle, you can see his club face angle or his, or his club to path is zero, it's right on. His face to path is, is square, so it's right on. You know, it was just a minor, minor off and that's why I just missed the target line. So, just let you watch him hit this shot. You know, so what's good is we can look at his video in those earlier videos and, and we can use the Telestrator here to, to draw on it, you know, to draw lines and help you understand what we're looking for, what we're looking at, communicate that to you, work, work indoors, work with the studio and in the mirrors, etc., different teaching aids and help you learn how to, how to get into the positions we want you in. So, anyways, if you're taking a look at the flight scope, it's a great application. We can help you learn about, about yourself and learn about the data of those shots. And we can do this indoors because that radar detector called flight scope, it, it just captures all this data. It's what they're using on the PGA Tour and we're using it here at McKenzie Meadows. So just wanted to give you a little insight into that in case you want to come down this winter and give it a try. Thanks. And